All right, everybody, welcome back to my updated version of Matthew B. 2 3,000 subscriber special for Great Buy 789, in which this time around, I'm going to be playing Family Feud for the Nintendo Switch. Let's have a great game, shall we? It may be evening, but don't make sundown fun day. Let's play Family Feud! Hello everyone, it's me, Lucky McCoy. Thank you for joining us here. What say we meet today's feuding families? Taking this game on solo. Please welcome the Lee family. Our families will be battling it out to answer your surveys. Whoever scores the most points goes on to fast money for the chance to win a lot of cash and a brand new car. It's time to get feuding. Here we go. It's time, time to face, face the, the first, first question, question in the face-off. Face -off. All right, people, get up here and do your families proud. The full board, we're going to need eight answers. Be sure to buzz in when you've got an answer to the survey question. If you're first to find the number one answer, you get to decide if your family will play or pass the round. We took a survey of 100 people, asking them, Name something romantic. Nice reflexes, Tex. We have an answer. Let's check the board and see if it made it. Flowers. That's correct with a capital K, which means it's there. But there's still a better one. We're still looking for the top answer, by the way. Name something romantic.
Nice. nice. Show me that answer. Gifts. Oh, swing and a miss. So, are you gonna play or pass? I think you've got this one. Let's play. We need another answer from you. That's good. Our survey says, jewelry. Nope, not up there. So here's your first strike. Oops. Dig deep and think of an answer. Oh, too late. Good. Okay. Did any of our 100 people say it? Bench. That's another strike. Name something romantic. Okay. Do we have it? Dinner. Uh, oh no, strike three. We could be about to witness a steal. We just need one answer, and if it's on the board, the round is yours. Find a good answer, and you'll get all the points. Yes. Let's see if you're right. Talking. No steal. You win this round. What are the answers we didn't find? Let's see the least popular answer. Book. Number seven. Dancing. The sixth most popular answer. Love letter. The fifth answer is... Poetry. And number four, please. Music. Show me the number three answer. Candles. What was the top answer? Movie. What are those scores doing? Only one round down, there's still everything to play for. Get ready to go full Nick Cage, because it's time for the face-off. One person from each team, come down and join me here at the front. I'm gonna need six answers, friends. Get ready to buzz in when you have an answer. 100 people gave us an answer to this question. Name something that could ruin a mermaid wedding. You're first on the buzzer. What you got? That's what you think, huh? Survey said, low tide. 
Wow, that's the way to answer. Now here's the million dollar question, play or pass. We're on the lookout for another win. Let's get to it. Time to search your mind for an answer. Ah, yes. Let's run with it. Hurricane. Excellent job. What answer do you have for us this time? That's your answer. Show me the answer. Shark. There it is. What do you think? We need another answer. Okay, then. Let's see what the survey says. Fishing. Nice job. Oh, wow. Name something that could ruin a mermaid wedding. That's a good answer. You sure about that? Let's see it. Tsunami. Look at that beautiful board. Almost full. Nice. Ooh, this is so exciting. There's just one uncovered answer up there. Oops. Got it. Crap. Is that the last answer on the board? It should be oil. Ouch. Sorry. You've earned yourself a strike. All right. This is it. One answer left. Uh-huh. Interesting answer. Is it up there? Oil. Oh no, you struck out again. Name something that could ruin a mermaid wedding. Yep. Is it there? Sea Witch. Ouch. Third strike. Ho oh, ho. Like my friend Al Capone used to say, our other family has a chance to steal. All they've got to do is find one answer on the board, and they can steal the round. If it's up there, you steal the points. If not, they go to the other family. All right, let's try it. Let's see if it's there. Seafood menu. You've blown it. This round goes to you. But you knew that, didn't you? There's only one answer left over. And the sixth most popular answer, oil spill. Oh. All right, let's see where we're at. Hope you all can get some points on the board next round. Are you ready for a face-off? Who's playing this time? Get yourselves over here. Top six answers on the board. Time to take it to the next level with double points. We asked 100 people to give us an answer to this. Name something you think of when you hear the word grind. You buzzed in first.
Here we go, then. Is it on the board? Work! You're on the board, but it's not the number one answer. Can you find the top answer? It's still up there. Name something you think of when you hear the word grind. Say it with confidence. Let's see if that's a correct answer. Gears! It's there, but it can't beat the other answer. So, what are you going to do here? Play or pass? And they're playing again. You can do it. What do you think? It's worth a shot. Time to check the board. Coffee. Perfecto. Do you have an answer for us? Feeling lucky? Did our survey say it? Dance. Bingo. Yay! Name something you think of when you hear the word grind. All right. Is it up there? Let's hope so. Teeth! We are nearly there. Got another answer? I see where you're going with this. Will this make a clean sweep? Let's find out. Meat. That's the final answer. And this round goes to you. Are you ready to see the scores? Let's reveal. One family may be zero for three. But I can feel a big turnaround coming just around the bend. No way! Now, let's do the face-off. I'm gonna need one person from each family to join me right now. We want the top four answers to this question. Now the points are worth triple, so this game is still up for grabs. We've got answers from 100 people for this question. Name something you wish you could find the off button for. You're up first. What do you got? Okay, okay, sure. sure. Let's, Let's see, see if the, the board's, board's got it. Children. Children. It's, it's there, there, but it's, it's not time. time. It's, it's your, your go. go. What, what do you think? think? Name something, something you, you wish, wish you could find the off button, button for. Answer, Answer accepted. accepted. Is it up there? Show me. Phone. Unlucky. What's it going to be? Play or pass? Wow, they must feel good about this one. They're going to play again. Guess what? We need an answer. That's what you're going with? Did anyone in the survey say this? Stress. 
You failed to find an answer, which means you get your first strike of the round. Let's hope you haven't run out of ideas yet. Oh, okay. Is that one of the remaining answers? Boss! Another strike! Name something you wish you could find the off button for. Sure thing. And what did our survey say? Spouse! It's the number one answer. Boom! Put on your thinking cap. It's time for an answer. Okie dokie. Let's take a look. Pet! Dang, that's three strikes. Sorry, folks. It's time for the other team to have a crack at this. If they can find just one answer, this family will steal the board. You've got a shot here. Understood. Our survey said, Games console. That's not what we're looking for. They're going for the Grand Slam over here. What were our leftover answers? Number four, show yourself. TV. Let's see number three. Vacuum cleaner. Let's take a final look at those scores. We have a winning family! Who needs a family to win this game? You're going on to fast money. Well, it's time to say goodbye to the lovely Lee family. Are you ready to play fast money? All right, my lonesome lovely. Since you didn't bring anyone with you, you're going to have to answer these questions twice. I'm going to ask you five questions. I need you to give me the most popular answers. You'll do it once, then we'll come back around and do it again since you're all on your own. Get more than 200 points, and you're taking home the jackpot. Your time starts now. Name something you can't wait to get out of at the end of your day. Name something you want for Christmas that's too big to get down the chimney. If your boss answers your phone, name someone you hope isn't calling. When a little kid uses a dirty word, Name some place he might tell his mom he heard her. Name a word or phrase that can follow the word Swiss. We're all questioned out. Let's give these another whirl and see how you do. You need to answer the questions again, but this time make sure you say something you haven't said already. Ready? Ready? Start, Start the, the clock. clock. Name something you can't wait to get out of at the end of your day. Name something you want for Christmas that's too big to get down the chimney. If your boss answers your phone, name someone you hope isn't calling. When a little kid uses a dirty word, Name some place he might tell his mom he heard her. Name a word or phrase that can follow the word Swiss. All right, that's all five of them. 
That's all the answers you can give. Well done. How do you think you did? Let's find out. First up, we wanted you to tell us. Name something you can't wait to get out of at the end of your day. The answers you gave. I think you can be pleased with those answers. Just one of those answers scored some points. Shoes! That was our top answer. Question two. Name something you want for Christmas that's too big to get down the chimney. This is how you answer. Those look like some mighty fine answers. We found the most popular one. Question three. If your boss answers your phone, name someone you hope isn't calling. So here's what you said. I think we might be good on this one. Points all around for these two. What do you think the top answer was? Parents. For this question, we asked, when a little kid uses a dirty word, name someplace he might tell his mom he heard it. What were your answers? You ought to be happy with those answers. That's a mighty fine answer, and one that's, let's just say, move on, shall we? The top answer? School. And the final question? Name a word or phrase that can follow the word Swiss. You said. And for the last time, You were so close. Unfortunately, you didn't do well enough to win that jackpot. Looks like you won't get the $20,000, but you'll still get to go away with something. We're going to take your score from the whole game and turn it into some money. Thanks a thousand times for playing. See you back here soon. Goodbye. Come on, you're not gonna leave it like that, are you? How about a rematch?